After 3,000 years of being native to the island of Tasmania, the Tasmanian Devil is set to return to the Australian mainland as part of a scientific study into maintaining struggling ecosystems. They got their name from early European settlers who stumbled upon this dog-like animal with red ears, wide jaws, and big, sharp teeth, which led them to call it the Devil. It's the largest marsupial carnivore in the world, and the Tasmanian Devil is an iconic symbol of native Australian wildlife. So the ambition to bring these guys to the state of New South Wales was an easy choice. It's unknown why the species disappeared from Australia thousands of years ago, but it's likely due to human actions. When early hunters killed off most of the continent's megafauna, the devils had nothing left to eat. But now, these cuddly yet ferocious critters have been reintroduced to the mainland by animal conservation groups. The tiny natural predator will help maintain the balance of the Australian ecosystem by scaring off introduced threats such as feral and domesticated cats and helping native animals to thrive. After a few years of testing, with small populations being observed under close human supervision, the group set about the unprecedented experiment to reintroducing the Tassie Devil in the wild. In March 2020, 15 devils were released unsupervised, but after initial success in their new home, 11 more of the sharp-toothed scavengers have been introduced into the environment. The animals are monitored but are left to their own devices to see how the species thrive under natural conditions. Tasmanian devils have been known to experience life-threatening illnesses, such as mouth cancer. Efforts to treat and assist them made this experiment especially important. This tireless effort means that the devils have the best possible chance for survival as they acclimate. Tasmanian devils are crafty and ingenious survivors. They prefer to scavenge for their food than hunt. The primarily carnivorous explorers are naturally predisposed to adapt to the wilds of the Australian mainland. This return to one of their original habitats is a milestone for animal conservation. If the reintroduction is successful, more iconic Australian species will be making a new home on the mainland as part of the following experiments. As for now, these little devils are just getting settled in. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it, and please like and subscribe for more content in the future.